one of the more bizarre aspects of recording videos for YouTube is that you have to kind of give some sort of personality for yourself. I mean, otherwise people are coming to you exclusively for the content you're producing, and if your content is commentary over gaming, you need to have something to actually show. In terms of who I am, it's very clear to me that I need to try a little harder and just open up, because I've always been bad about that. I'm not trying to make any kind of excuse for myself, of course. I'm just stating the, f the facts as I can see them. But it's surprising to me how poorly I do when I try to make any kind of preset content. Realistically, I think the problem is more just I, I'm a very genuine person when I'm actually being a person. And that's not exactly an easy thing for me to do sometimes. However, we all strive to do better with what we love, right? So, what I'm going to be doing is simply just doing a reset. I'm not going to be deleting any of my content, but I'm going to be drastically overhauling how I work on my videos. This is to make better content overall, and honestly, I want something that people are going to actually enjoy, because I hear all these comments about, oh, you lost me at such and such point, because you go very quiet, and not much happens, you die over and over again, and have to keep going back to the same points, that kind of a thing. I understand this. I need to put more time into editing. Almost exclusively more time into editing, because there's not much I really feel like I can do in terms of making myself be more enjoyable. I've tried. I can't do it. But I, I'm wanting to basically reset everything and try again. So I'm going to... I don't want to slowly implement things, but I don't want to make such drastic change that it alienates people who actually did watch the older content. So I've decided that there's going to be a nice little middle ground for this. We're going to be interchanging the changes while working on new content. Firstly, the new content I've already worked on has been a new intro. This relies on old footage, so it's not alienating anyone in that regard. It's still a part of who I am, and I just need to remember that I don't want to go back to that. I want to do better. I want to be better at this. The next thing I'm going to be doing is next week I'm going to be starting a new series just fresh off the ground a lot of people have probably seen the poll that I posted uh, earlier this week results have been in and everyone wants to see a Nuzlocke of Pokemon Emerald that's fine I've never been good at the third gen games but I'm going to try anyway as I said expect failure and uh, should something happen if I happen to get a full wipe, the Pokemon that's leading the charge in that instance will wind up being used for the channel mascot. I want something that's going to be something I can go back to and just... How do I say this in a way that makes sense? I'm sure people remember the... Uh, a little Gorgeist icon I had had in the bottom corner of the screen during some of the last videos I had posted. You know, most of the content I did end of last year. I want to make that more of an official thing. 
So it's not exactly going to be branding the video per se, but it's definitely going to be saying, hey, this is something that I think is okay for everyone to watch. So it's not going to be present on live streams, um, but it, and it's not going to be present on any other kind of content that I think, you know, maybe not as kid friendly. And if I ever need to censor something out in a video that's supposed to be kid friendly, I use that Pokemon's Cry. That's just because I feel like that's a funny sensory sound. <laughs> but. <sighs> I've been needing to do this change for a while. Honestly, it's kind of a relief to finally be getting this off my chest. And uh, in case anyone was wondering, yes, this is probably going to be what I do for Halloween this year. I'm going to forgo all the all the stuff I had done previously for Halloween. I do want to have something ready this time next year, though. Um, I've been meaning to do this for two years now, and I still haven't done it. But hopefully, between now and this time next year, I'll have had enough practice to make it a bit better of a reality. We're gonna see what happens. And of course, we're coming up to 100 subscribers. We've been sitting at 95 for God knows how long. And it's also almost five years of doing YouTube. I'm a little shocked that it's been five years and we've not come anywhere close to f that far but I guess that's kind of telling to my content because most of my old subscribers are friends who never watch so maybe that's a sign that I need to try and flip a switch start working better on things put more time in so yeah Emerald's gonna be coming out this time next week, we're close enough. I want to get back into the live streaming again, of course. Uh, I will be trying to finish Undertale. And as I've been doing for the past goodness knows how long, uh, I think it's only been a month, but I am going to stop posting the Team Fortress 2 content and the... Uh, I'm not going to post any of the Terraria content onto YouTube anymore. That's going to be exclusively through Twitch. So if you're not subscribed, or not subscribed, if you're not following me on Twitch, you might want to go do that now. I try to keep those links down at the bottom of the page. Uh, so go, go check that. And... I can't think of anything else that really needs to be done at the current moment. So I guess I'll just see you around when I get back into doing what I like to do.